what I did is I went ahead and laid out the first row here. Uh, some of these have a little bit of dirt on them. Like I said, they're from uh, the farm. They were free and they'd probably been sitting there for a long time. So what I'm gonna do here is uh, run a quick time lapse of what, uh, what it looks like to lay these out. So here we go. I'm just gonna put uh, two nails per, two nails per shingle. Now when I say I'm going two nails per shingle, I'm not sure if that's the way you should be doing it. It's just the way I'm going to do it. Now I don't know if you can see in the video how these work. Like I said, they're called T-lock shingles. So that's how they go together right there. Put another one in there, show you. So I kind of pulled the flaps up and in like that, boom, T lock. Put you back in the holster. Those lines I talked about it earlier, you can use to make sure that your shingles are staying in line when you lay this out. do just like I did the tar paper uh, once I get these shingles put in place I'll go and cut off the edges so that's why I'm having the overhang right now and when I get about halfway through that's when I'll cut this bottom and then I'll reuse them on the top See this one here. A little bit of dirt still on it. It's 
not going to hurt anything. All right, so uh, three quarters of the way through, I'm gonna go ahead and let you go and finish up. And then once I get done, I'll show you the end product. Mm -hmm. 